news out of North Texas this morning in the case of a kidnapped woman. Police announced they have found her alive hundreds of miles from home. CBS News correspondent Don Teague has the story. When police in Texas discovered 54-year-old Eileen Lascott had been abducted on her way home from work early Thursday morning, they feared the worst. We absolutely believe that she is a victim of foul play. Lascott was working the late shift at this Dallas printer. She left at 1 a.m., but just a few blocks from home, her car was hit from behind. It was a staged accident to get her out of the motor vehicle, yes, sir. She immediately called home to tell her husband Gary about the accident, but got voicemail. He retrieved the message several hours later and called police. All indications are that the phone was, was turned on during the course of the conversation, probably unknown to her captors. After forcing Lascott back into her car, they headed south about 50 miles to the town of Cedar Hill. On this bank surveillance video, Lascott is seen about an hour later making three ATM withdrawals, taking out $900. Her captors then forced her to drive into New Mexico, where they finally released her. Lascott turned back toward Texas, then contacted authorities in Vega, Texas, 375 miles from home. She is doing very well. Police have arrested one man, a registered sex offender, who confessed to the kidnapping. The other two are still on the loose, presumably in New Mexico. Don Teague, CBS News, Dallas.